Welcome everyone to our tutorial. In this video, we're gonna discuss the sales page for instructors. This page allows instructors to track and manage their course sales efficiently. The feature provides an overview of all transactions associated with their courses and enables instructors to drill down into detailed reports for individual sales. Let's see how it works. There are no settings to turn on. Just go to the instructor's dashboard and move to the My Sales page. The interface is very user-friendly and understandable. A date range is selected at the top right corner of our page. You can choose the range and get the data within the necessary period. Next to the page title, there is a total number of orders persisted within the date range. We can use the search field to quickly find the order you need. The sales table is powered by page navigation and control of the orders displayed per page features which enable seamless navigation across orders. If you are selling courses with WooCommerce in your LMS, WooCommerce orders will also be displayed in this table. You can apply ascending or descending sorting options for columns. In columns you can find info about unique order ID, creation date, student's name and email, number of items included in the order, payment method, status, and total amount of transaction. Note that, on the My Sales page, you can only get info about the orders. However, you cannot change the order status or related settings. To manage orders, you have to refer to the Orders tab in the WordPress dashboard. If you are using WooCommerce for checkout, you have to manage them in the WooCommerce Orders tab. In the last column, there is a special button that brings you to the detailed report for the selected order. On this page, you can find the full billing info, billing address, and items included in the order as well as a special button to print the order details. Your site logo will automatically paste it here. If you are using WooCommerce for checkout, you can set this logo by following Master Study LMS, Settings, General, and uploading the logo to the designated area. I hope you find the sales pages useful. Smash the like button and do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.